it. Of eternity. Uh, thanks for all the subs, guys. Uh, Sari Tarilla, Manly Gugu, Zatoichi Eight, Shopik, Mewf, Kormas, Smurf, Sufistas, Tim Freily. I shall not return to that prison. Mcox One, Rolliet G, Young Titan, Lol. A Chinese name that I am sure I can't read. Let me translate it. Beauty Jingle. Beauty Jingle. Mei Ding Dang. Mei Ding Dang. <laughs> Thank you. Terror Rope, Baddest. Bales Deep. I'll choose to pronounce it that way. Burrito Man and Guzor SE, Gen Master Ferris. Thanks, guys. Hey, Grubby, how do I get out of Diamond? I've climbed from Platinum 5 to Diamond 3. Congrats, well done. I'm still running into games with 8 Death Novas and Chogals. How is this happening more in Diamond than Platinum? I don't know, but rest assured, if you keep. want to see something else than the boring meta picks. Play something exciting. I suggest Nova or Valera Kappa. I'll play Vala. I stand ready. Uh, and I don't think that's true because the new viewers don't know what the meta is. And I'll just go and say that Valera and Nova aren't that good. Right now. Uh, but yeah, just keep doing what you're doing and keep in mind that the people that are doing that fratty light will eventually be left behind by you. Over the over the hole. And if you think someone is report reportable, like they're legitimately trying to lose the game, then just Reading report them. Spread. But if they're just not good and they take suboptimal heroes, just hope that they're on the other team next game, you know? I hear I'm obeying. Zarya, ready for duty. My donation didn't show up. AGX Duke. That's because there is a bit of a, a bit of a queue. Because there were so many people that subbed and donated and followed tonight. I'll read it out for you now. Will there be more StarCraft coming? Und dein Deutsch klingt lustig. <laughs> uh, my next StarCraft remastered stream, I think will be on Friday the 25th and I think I'm gonna be doing it every Friday but not this one not tomorrow so yes once a week until otherwise Wait, what's this? Homeless? Homeless X LFT. The timeless cult is spreading. Victory of the wall. Make way for the bad guy. I feel kind of not hip anymore. I don't have an X name. Like an X LFT name. Do you still play Clash of Clans? Uh, I've never played Clash of Clans. I do play Clash Royale. Uh, and there was a time I played something like Clash of Clans, but don't play it anymore. Greetings, friend. Why did Grubby have 13k views? We were on the front page of Twitch. It ended half an hour ago. Ready for adventure. Greetings. Uh, for climbing, would you recommend a smaller hero pool, flexible, or doesn't matter? What do you recommend? I recommend having three heroes you're really comfortable with. Not all in the same role. Let's say two roles, three total. For example, you have one Greetings. tank that you really love, one specialist you really love, and one assassin. And you just cycle between those three based on what the draft needs best, based on your understanding of the hero. And then you have another 5 to 10 that you can flex to, that your really comfort level spring. isn't 10 out of 10 on, but maybe 8 out of 10 or 7 out of 10. And you will fill if needed. 
don't only gravitate towards filling every single game to the very best of your draft understanding even at the cost of lack of comfort do play for comfort but do play for what the team needs to for example every time i see that the team isn't picking a warrior i'll take one of my best tanks but if i'm first pick i'm also allowed to take something else for example damage i can still go tank but i can also go vala and i'm comfortable with vala if if uh, the best pick would be Genji, I wouldn't take it because I'm not uh, comfortable on Genji. Hey, Decepti, how's it going? Fight as one, and none shall resist us. Good to see a friendly face around here. Come, let's join the hunt. Uh, so let's talk about uh, threats. We have one and a half warrior, one and a half support. Two assassins. We have four that deal decent damage. Lily, Zarya, Samura, Vala. I'm the only ranged assassin. I'm the most attractive Five, target four, together with Lily, three, probably. Two, one. Uh, they have two warriors well, with heroes. good reach, either with a god swap dash and face prism swap, or Murdin's jump in and storm bolt. And then Ooh, they have a threatening backline of Zuljin and uh, Nazibo. I stuck off with the silence. That means I cannot always 100% rely on my vault saving me. Our support is going to be strapped for mana. She also didn't take mana talent. So we must reduce the amount of meaningless poke damage we take. She said as she got trapped in the zombie wall. And uh, wasted everything. What if you usually play better filling than first picking? Uh, I mean, if you're first pick, you still have to first pick, you know? Anyway, I need to focus a bit. The arm is uh, well played. The lurking arm is very disruptive. I will go for a little hearthstone. I, will soon crush my enemy. I don't think Garrus was a great choice this game. He has low damage on the immortal. We're against a very tanky team. Some of the more survivable ranged assassins, two tanks. And we have no stun follow up. So I don't really see what he brings for us. But once you have a pick. Resolve never to complain about it uh, to your allies because you can't change it anyway. Hey, thank you very much, Katras. Garros just killed someone. Yep. <laughs> but that's a classic. As soon as you say something to be true on stream, you'll always be proven the opposite. That's a good that's a good one, I like it. Choose a talent. Yeah, I'm going full arrow build. It's really good on BOE. I'll just stay long enough for the globe and then I'm gonna go top. As you wish. Can you explain XLFT? Yeah. Uh, there's this player, Timeless. And he plays a lot and he's in every stream game because he tries to meet the streamer. He's a good player and yeah, he has like double the games anyone else. And his name is Timeless XLFT and people have started copying him because he has such a peculiar playstyle and pick style I do like to be proven wrong about a pick especially when he's on my side I will I will 
What's peculiar about his play pick style? Uh, he's got good mechanics. He has good minimap awareness. He's just, he's really solid. He does get prone to tilting sometimes, but anyone would that plays like 200 games a day. And he always one tricks a hero for a while. Whether that's Butcher or Thrall or Taronda, he goes through this phase of picking it like 50 times in a row. And by that time, everyone knows it. Before it was Illidan. Like, everyone finds out whatever he's playing, and I would say he's opened some people's eyes about certain heroes. He was the first to start spamming Taronda before she became a popular top pick. Except he didn't do that well with her yet. She got a little buff after he mastered. That was enough to uh, for everyone. For everyone to start playing her and get more success. I didn't even see the prison. Let us move. Yeah, he's got a really Shall solid win rate on Butcher too. Uh, the pre-rework. I don't know if he still plays him now. Took two damage, two poke damage from the tower, which is not good. Double kill. I don't know why he would take Garrosh, you know, I don't really see what he can do here. <laughs> Inekio, yo, thanks for the sub, dude. Killing spree. So I considered the Butcher rework as nerf, but I see the value of 25 meat per kill and I just don't think Garrosh can really... I think it is a nerf, but it's also a bu buff. It's a burf. I mean, that was obvious from the text, but it's better than I thought. Oh, my hungering went to nowhere. We need to farm for ten. I am renewed. Here. I mean, we don't need to, but we can, and it's really good. The immortal is in a very difficult position to attack into, but my team is doing it anyway. Nice. That's okay. That's okay. That's not okay. Lily does not have enough mana for a cup of 1000 cups. Rain of Vengeance. That was unfortunate. I was super stuck there. I never remain anywhere for Super body block. Greetings, friend. As you wish. Pity. Greetings, friend. Why did he jump here? A good kill, Why did he jump in? <laughs> Any last words? I depart. Your fear betrays you. Uh. 
Oh! <laughs> it was Garrosh, of course. Me smart! I still don't think Garrosh's potential though. If Murder is gonna jump in and go kill himself, I don't think that's because of uh, Garrosh or anything like that. Let's go take a Merc camp. That's not a good idea. Stealing that never really works. I would like to have someone top still. There's so much XP there. Merlin jump in, <laughs> Koppa. Okay, quick talent review. Toad build, lurking arm build, auto attack build. Follow through. You angels shall know the taste of fear. How are they doing so well on the immortal? Thought we should be doing better. <laughs> Oh my toad. So we have to defend now? I think so. Wait, they're not attacking. Uh, they're attacking with one. Okay, we kill them all. Sweet revenge. Double kill. Nice. Swift and silent. I'm ready to continue. Throwing in Lily, though. Hey, word. thanks. Thank you very much, man. Fetch and Shadow. No oh, I'm blinded. Hearthstone. 
whatever grace of Lily we enjoyed, it's gone now. It's gone. I must retreat for now. Uh, but it looks like they might want to push our Swift forward. And silent. Can't let that happen though. They're gonna take Impaler and then we have to defend Impaler. Manticore. <laughs> Servatores. Thank you, man. It's not my birthday. Yes, I see. Okay, I'm with Manticore because I'm getting a lot of consecutive auto attacks on Artanis and Muradin, I'm noticing. That one auto attack. Killing spree. Oh. He needs to. Okay, I'm not gonna counsel him because I want him to think with his own mind, and I could just make him feed. But just looking at the situation, having two alive, you would wait until our immortal starts taking massive damage, and then you throw two grenades on it. Greetings, like you would want to tip the point Robbie, now, I had the craziest dream so that we night. put it on the 50%, and we have time to come there. back. I woke up exhausted. Happy 11 months. What's a muffler? Tired of this Thank you very much, uh, dude. Okay, let's try that again. Yeah, this was a safer play, not going uh, up there. Let's go take a merc camp. You're Survive that. Double kill. Triple kill. The Lily Hills, man, is crazy. Get the globes. Crazy. Lily build, blinding wind, shrink ray, shake it off. Standard. It's just the jokes, and the like. If you do the blind right before the jokes, the survivability is so great. And then we have Zarya as well. So nice. So many close escapes. I would have been dead five times more if we had no support or Zarya. I don't like this gargantuan. That's all we need. 
They will try to re-engage, yeah. Prime Agent 63, thanks, dude. I was surprised the first hit from it uh, killed him. I get uh, Far Flight Quiver. What a foolish boy! <laughs> Only some arrow clear, maybe. The path needs this. We have level lead. On your guard, heroes. The unending war moves toward you. I have my rain hit. Dead. I should have had better aim prediction. Hell has always been the greater power, Angel. We're still level 20 advantage, but the Immortal's in a really good spot for them. Wait, how come they don't have keeps? When did we kill the keeps? My heart continues. Hey Muko, I've done your game like a week ago, bruh. It's already on YouTube, like yesterday. Cast my initial Q. Samuro uh, split push, huh? Can I tap again? I can, but it's better just to start attacking. I'm not sure why they're not defending. This is a 100% win. Like, we get this immortal, it's over. They, they should just try to defend 3v5. 3v5, I think. The minions of hell have pleased me. I mean, there's Katas too. Yes, I see. Uh, cries of agony will echo throughout the heavens. No 
It's an ugly win, but it's a win. <laughs> I missed one uh, hungering arrow that was pretty bad. Victory. <laughs> Uh, I feel like I got carried. I, I got good numbers, but the survivability that Zarya and Lily offered was amazing. And Garrosh, I felt, I felt Garrosh was um, uh, really not a fantastic pick here, but he did really, really great. Greetings, Absorbed a lot friend. of damage. Got some really important kills early that managed to secure the game, like the early game for us. Everyone doing good hero damage. And Lily is the type of good hero damage hero as well. He has the full blind build storm shield. Deadly calm, yeah, that one is so good. Earth shaker into the fray. Warbreaker and the defensive measures. So he has the in combat sustain uh, talents. He brings his cooldown on Groundbreaker from 8 to 5 and then gets a shield every time he does it. And then auto attacks give him more Bloodthirst which is the uh, PvE and PvP sustain damage. Not a lot of damage but a bit of heals. Really cool. How do you pick between multi strike versus arrow build? Uh, arrow is good on Battlefield of Eternity. It's also good for soloing people. Multi shot is better for wave clear and when your support is Aureal. The one build that is, seems very attractive but doesn't do that well is uh, um, auto attack. The quest takes long to complete and Vala's auto attack is very solid even without fully skilling into it. It's probably better to invest in the other talents. Yes! Insta Towers of Doom pick. Keep destroyed. Another tower under my dominion. 